Hello everyone. During this unusual time that we cannot meet together to worship God as a local church, we are encouraging every baptized believer of Jesus Christ to observe the Lord's Supper or communion together with your family in your home. So this video is about who can facilitate and who can participate in the Lord's Supper. And who and what do you need to prepare so that we can do this together in our homes this coming Sunday, April 12th. So first, who can lead? Ideally, it should be the husband or the father as the head of the family. But he must be a baptized believer of Jesus Christ. However, in the case that the head of the family is not a believer, then the next in line of the family who is a believer should do it. If that is the wife, the grandparent, the eldest son or daughter, the important thing is that the one leading is a baptized believer of Jesus Christ. So who can participate? If you have children, they can participate on one condition, that they have clearly understood the gospel and have expressed personally that they believe in Jesus Christ and love Him as their Lord and Savior. Thirdly, what do you need to prepare? You, you can prepare the two elements, the bread and the wine, or its equivalent. So for the bread, if you do not have sliced bread, if you do not have pandesal, uh, you can have equivalents such as these. Uh, you can have bread pan. You could use sky flakes. You could use fita or whatever equivalent that will serve as the bread. For the wine, if you do not have grape juice, you could use wine or uh, you could use uh, if you don't have juice, you don't have wine, you could use, just use water. That will do, water. And you would put the water in small cups or small glasses of, and then serve them come this Sunday. So this Sunday, after the sermon, I will then lead us to observe the Lord's Supper and you can then facilitate it in your home so that we can do this together. May the Lord bless each and every one of you.